Good day, children. Today, we are going to continue with our lesson, Unit 8, The Robot, from the Superminds textbook, page 102. For today's lesson, we're going to start off with Listen and Read, a text from page 102. We're going to try to match the animals, and we're going to do some simple practices about what animals can do. So now let's start with Listen and Read from our textbook, page 102. Now Listen and Read, you can refer to our textbook, page 102. Humans and some animals have got skeletons. That's right. Humans and some animals have got skeletons. Now, the skeleton help us to swim. The skeleton helps us to walk. The skeleton helps us to run. The skeleton helps us to see. The skeleton helps us to stand. So now let's try to match the animal skeletons. Now let us try to match the animals with the skeleton. We have frog, crocodile, giraffe, rat, and monkey. So, A, hey, what animal is this? Very good. It's a giraffe. What about this skeleton for B? Which animal is it? Amazing! It's a frog. Now, what animal is this based on a skeleton? Well done! It's a crocodile. What about this animal skeleton? Yes, it's a rat. And what about the last skeleton? Correct! It's a monkey. Let's see what animals can do. We have here giraffe. So, giraffes can walk. What about frog? Frogs can jump. What about crocodile? Crocodiles can crawl. What about rat? Rats can run. What about monkey? Monkeys can run. Monkeys can swim. Now, for today's homework, we are going to read and write the correct actions based on the skeleton. So, let's read. Skeletons. Human and some animals have got skeletons. The skeleton helps us to swim, walk, run, sit, or stand. So, based on the first picture, what do you think skeleton help us to do? You can choose your answer from here. Swim, walk, run, sit or stand. So the answer is walk. Well, very good. So for question number 2 to question number 5, I'll leave it up to you to complete the task. That's all for me today. Thank you class. Bye.